Oh, man, this is really living. Yo, what's up? I'm driving home from the final, <coughs> well, not the final, but really the final Philly Senior Stage performance. We have one more, which is over a month from now, but that's more like an encore performance. That's how I view it. Um, it's on February 27th. It's January 25th right now. It's my mother's birthday. Went to lunch with her today. Then had a performance in Doylestown, and now I'm heading home. It's 9.33. Um, this experience has been really, really beneficial to me and to my family. Um, real estate was very slow this fall, and if it were not for this opportunity of performing regularly, um, you know, I don't know what I would have done. I would have probably had to take on another job of some kind, uh, just to kind of make sure that we were not uh, struggling too much. Uh, but all that to say, you know, as long as I stay focused, the fact that the money's coming in from a variety of sources doesn't bother me. As long as I'm, I know I'm working hard, um, whether it's acting or singing or doing real estate, um, that is not what drives me as much as I just want to... I want to spend my time doing as much as I can so that I have no regrets. Um, and, you know, praise God that this opportunity came when it did. Very thankful, very grateful for it. Now that it's ending, you know, it gives you a lot of perspective on things like that. <sighs> so tomorrow night is opening night of FaceTimes Into the Woods. We had three tech rehearsals this week. Today was our off night, even though I performed <laughs> um, with another, with the Philly Senior Stage. So, tomorrow night, and then two on Saturday. And then I'm actually singing um, a special song at church on Sunday morning. So, it's going to be a very full weekend of performance. Um, but that's what I love to do. And uh, I will talk to you guys soon. He's got the two minute call. Four curtain tour into the woods of FaceTime. Very exciting. Hey guys, I just dropped off uh, the gear from Philly Senior Stage. It's been in my possession since the beginning of September. Bittersweet to say goodbye to that run. Uh, we do have an encore performance at the end of February, which I mentioned uh, before on the show. And you'll probably hear more about that as that time draws near. Uh, another thing, you're going to start seeing more transition from acting emphasis to real estate emphasis because we're about to hit the spring market. I know it's snowing outside right now, but the spring market kind of begins February 15th in real estate, uh, the real estate industry. And I have a new listing coming on the market in the next couple days, which you'll be seeing more about. It's in Buckingham Township. Bucks County. <clears throat> it's going to be listed. It's a three bedroom, two and a half bath, end unit townhome, finished basement. It's going to be for, listed at 425. <clears throat> so that's exciting. I also have a meeting with some potential buyers tomorrow night. Uh, so I'm praising God for some real estate opportunities after some slow months. And uh, Today, I'm actually heading right now to take my kids out of school <coughs> for the Philly Auto Show. It's been, become an annual tradition. We've gone the last two years, and today, uh, even though it's wet and snowy, I thought it would be fun to run down to Philly and, and check out some of those vehicles. So, it's a good father-son time. Say hi, Leland. Say hi up in the camera. I think I've made a horrible mistake. Who's down there? So 
good old TV show. have some uh, bed face, I guess I'll call it. You can see it around my eye there. Right around here. Anyway, um, yesterday was a very busy day in the real estate world, which is great. I met with a friend of mine, an old friend, and uh, who's thinking about getting into real estate. Gave her some advice. <laughs> um, and then worked on getting my listing ready which is coming on the market in the next day or two <clears throat> and also met with some friends who are looking to buy a house and uh, that's very exciting um, I always say one of my favorite parts about working with friends is that it gives me an excuse to hang out with them for weeks months at a time uh, in a very uh, focused endeavor, I guess you could call it. So if you're a friend of mine, or you want to be my friend, there's no better way than to ask me to be your realtor, because we're going to spend a lot of time talking to each other, texting, becoming the best of friends. Hey guys, I am heading to Family Stages audition number two. Um, I auditioned a while back for these guys, and it's a similar operation to Philly Senior Stage from what I gather. Uh, except for the demographic is kids instead of seniors. Um, I'm taking time out from my part-time job. I put a listing on the market yesterday and I've gotten lots of showings scheduled. I think we're up to 11 or 12. That's exciting. Hopefully we get some offers. Um, right now I'm stuck. They're doing some type of tree work or something and I'm at a dead stop. I'm going to head back to my print shop job. And then I have a performance this evening of Into the Woods. Another performance tomorrow night and Sunday afternoon. And then I'll bust it out and watch the Eagles in the Super Bowl. We got this. We got this. Ooh. 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 Oh. Yes! Oh, 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 oh. Take that to Brady! That's how you catch! Yeah! What a call! Oh my goodness! They go to the very, very, very back of the playbook for the touchdown. Let's play the whole game! If we stop, then the game is over. Who do you win the Super Bowl? I am Horned and I'm here. I'm so Just so you know, he probably will. During the field goal, um, I was like.
I didn't know he was a Christian too. And uh, it's a resilient group. I love this coaching staff, Mr. Lurie, the owner. And not only do we have the best fans in the world, we now have the best team in the world. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> 